people are here, Marine Max, Panama City Beach, standing in front of a showroom ready, 2020 Boston Whaler 230 Vantage. Light blue hull sides, fiberglass hardtop, anchor windlass, synthetic teak flooring. This is arguably the nicest 23 Vantage in the country. We're gonna hop inside, check out this unsinkable legend, and see why it's so great. Let's go step aboard. So we step inside the boat, you see why I said the nicest boat in the country. You got synthetic teak flooring. That isn't sea deck, that's actual teak. Spread out throughout this dual console cockpit. As you look at the dual console, you get a good idea of why these boats are more popular than center consoles. Check out the market registration, it's happening. But we've got an awesome amount of space here that if I want to fish, which this boat does have the fishing package, bait well down below. We've got our dance floor open where I can get in and I've got tow rails integrated to either side. Uh, you know, myself, my brother, my kids could fish the boat, one sit at the helm and entertain or, and fish. If we want to entertain, we change the layout of the boat and take advantage of this sunshade from this awesome fiberglass hardtop, color matched underside, but we could kick out that huge rear bench seat. And he may not be able to see it from where he's at, but we've got way overbuilt 316L stainless on that hardware. It is gas assisted. It is something that is just way overbuilt. You get a 230 pound grass fed, maybe a little protein, beefy boy like me. And I don't have to worry about breaking that. I don't think I would try that with the comp competition's boat. You've got 316L stainless that's been acid dipped and polished all the way around. Rod holders marked with Boston Whaler inside. We move over to the wet bar and entertainment area. We've got a food prep station. We've got wash down, Getty cooler, Corian countertops. There's not a lot about this boat that isn't just absolutely rich. One of my favorite features about dual consoles is how they are transformers. This boat transforms into multiple facets. We've seen the fishing layout with the open dance floor. We've seen the super comfortable rear bench seat that flips out if we're out and cruising. But from where you're standing, we can see what I've already converted into that big lounge. Flushed out, we've got room to lay all the way out. I'm five foot 14 inches tall and you can reach in here and have tons of room. If we want a front facing lounge, we kick up that back seat. We've got room to sit there and face forward. We want the full extension of that lounge. Pull that stainless handle, we can be rear facing, front facing and rear facing. And then we've got access for that special moment after Taco Bell night to jump into a full macerated pump out head, wash station, vent window, trim all the way around. Woo. Cut through up for the console. Um, you can close the windshield, protect yourself from the elements. If you added optional weather curtains, we would have that opportunity to run the boat even here on the Gulf Coast in the winter months. Um, it's been two years ago, but took one of the dual consoles over to Shell Island the day after Christmas with family I had in town from Illinois. Obviously they're swimming, enjoying it and being in the water. My frigid Florida blood said, eh, I'm gonna stay in the boat. But we were protected by the weather curtains. We had the back open, put its sweatshirts on in shorts and could go enjoy the water on a great fishing day, entertaining day, or even a Shell Island day. Big open bow seating, blank canvas open for electronics where we want to set it up for fishing and entertaining. And as all Boston Whalers are, we've got JL Audio pre-tuned from JL Audio from Boston Whaler right from the factory. Uh, the boat will blow your eardrums out and as a walking nightclub. Transformer, Fisher, Cruiser, Entertainer, performance boat, sport boat, powered by that Mercury four-stroke 300 Verado. The boat does it all. There's not a lot the boat can't do and can't do well. If she's not big enough, we do have a 27, a 32, 35, 38, and 42 in the Realm and Vantage series. But there's not much that Whaler can't answer to and not much of family that they can't have a boat that does well for them. Uh, once again, this is a 2020 Boston Whaler 230 Vantage, Marine Max Panama City Beach. Check us out at marinemax.com if you want to take a look at some of the other boats we've got to offer. Or if you've really enjoyed our content, head over to YouTube, like and subscribe, engage in the content, ask questions, and we'd be glad to help out. Once again, my name is Caleb. This is Marine Max in Panama City Beach atop the legendary and unsinkable legend, the Boston Whaler 230 Vantage. Thanks.